Hello guys, today I'll be showing you how to build a portable adjustable power supply for under $5. For this project, you'll need the following parts. I'll be using this empty jewelry box for my enclosure, but you could use whatever you like. You'll need three 18650 lithium ion battery. Excel 6009 buck boost converter. This is the main component. TP46 charging protection module that will be used to charge the batteries. 100 kilo ohm potentiometer. Voltage display meter. And we'll also need an on off switch. I will be wiring everything according to this diagram. This is how it looks all wired up. The most important thing to note is the 18650 LiPo batteries are wired in a parallel configuration. They are all soldered up and insulated using electrical tape. The other important thing to note is the built-in potentiometer has been replaced with a rotary one. So let's test everything before we put it into the enclosure to make sure everything works. And everything seems fine. The voltage is correct. The on off switch works. Okay, the assembly is finally complete and this is what it looks like. voltage range is from around 1.2 volts to around 40 volts but the display will only switch on when it's around 2.5 volts as you can see okay to charge this device just open it up and then it will give you access to the internal and this is this uh, charging board's got a standard micro usb charging port so i'll just plug it in And then there you go, it's charging. The red LED indicates it's charging. Once it turns green, it means it's complete. Okay. So now I'll show you the accuracy of the output. So I'm just going to plug this into my multimeter. There you go, it goes all the way up to 40 volts. Okay, let me try to power something up and then see how it behaves. So I'm going to switch it on and see what voltage is required to turn on this LED. So the LED is Fully bright around 2.8 volts. Okay, let's try something which needs a little bit more power. This is a 12 volt LED. Okay, around seven and a half volts, just about turns on. And yes, getting brighter. Fully bright at 12 volts. So let's test the power supply on a breadboard. I have a circuit on the breadboard that needs 12 volts to function correctly so I'm going to adjust the voltage so it gets closer to 12 volts and as you can see the LED is blinking which shows everything is working according to 
expectation. So overall I am actually quite happy with this portable adjustable power supply. It can be very useful for tinkering with breadboard projects and playing around with Arduino projects. If you are interested in building something like this, you'll find the links to the parts below. If you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.